Okay, hello there, welcome back. Uh, this video is just based on how we can kind of generate worksheets based on our the textbooks textbook that we're using and the problems in it to maybe make more um, activity based exercises that the students can fit into. So I'm just going to highlight question two. Write down the coordinates, find the midpoints, etc., and just how how we can use this in maybe a more um, you know, in more tro in a worksheet where the students get to practice over and over again, and um, it's it's more learning by doing, I think, than asking students to work out of the book. So here's here's um, a little bit of code in LaTeX, and every time I every time I execute, it will reorder the points. And it'll regenerate. It'll generate a point in each quadrant on on each sensed um, axis. So um, this way, I can create a worksheet which several of these and the general instruction can be to label them and to find midpoints and so on. Now, if we were to do midpoints in this, it would become too messy, but. Um, how this would be used then can be further can, is, is something I'd go to go to next. Okay, that was a minute and a half, which is too long. Uh, maybe um, thank you for your time up to now, and, and you'll see this then in a worksheet, maybe occurring as a six different exercises similar to this, like it could be one, two, three, four, five, six, etc., or as many as I like. But but you know, it, it's a question of finding the balance. Um, in terms of um differentiation, then um. Just by changing this number here, we change the number in the grid. That's the grid size. So f to differentiate it, we bring it down to a much smaller grid, and um, possibly as well, of course, differentiation will be staying within the the first quadrant and so on. But that'll all come in time. Just get an idea of the um, the stuff I'm messing around with um, in generating worksheets. It's all back back burner stuff at the moment, but. Um, uh, something that I think um, has has probably a place in 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 my practice okay see you in the next one